just made it to work. I'm a little bit late. So, I'm late, but I just wanted to get on here and speak this morning and say hello. And that I hope you guys have an amazing day. Um, I got a full day today in the office. And that's all, y'all. I got my water here. And I also got um, my uh, Celsius pack. Um, this gave me energy the last time I tried it. It gave me energy, so I need that energy for today. So I'm going to put this in my water for today, y'all. But it is 6.15, so I'm going to go ahead and um, get in this office, y'all. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I hope you guys just stay positive today. Stay positive. Um, think about your goals. And everything will be okay. So, I will pick you guys back up on my lunch break or once I get off. Oh, girl. I am off work. <laughs> and I am happy about it. Y'all, today's been a long day. When I say you today has dragged itself all day, I mean, it's been a very long day, y'all. How was you guys? It's Friday. Leave me a comment down below and let me know how your day was. I don't have too much I'm doing this afternoon. Um, all I have to do is uh, pick up Kingston and go to the house. But y'all, I got uh, some cleaning and organizing to do. I also need to get in my daughter's room. She she wants a makeover. Y'all know she's turning 15. I mean, she's turning 16. Her 16th birthday is in March. So, she wants a big girl room. So, I decided to go ahead and do her a makeover, y'all. I haven't... Uh, she haven't had new bedding, like a new bed. She She's in a twin-size bed, y'all. And the reason why she's in a twin size bed is because I had all my girls coming up, you know, I had a house full. I got five girls. So they had to share rooms. And I couldn't put big, large size beds in the room. So I, they had to do twin beds. I didn't do bump beds. I did twin beds. Well, when um, my daughter's moved, I got two that moved out. So I let her have her own room and I let my daughter that's in college have her own room and then there's a room downstairs where my uh, my other daughter she she sleeps downstairs in that room and then there's my room but anyway um yeah so I never did upgrade their beds I just moved the twin size bed out of her room into the other room for my daughter that's in college so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna uh get her a bigger bed which i'm thinking a queen size bed if if not a queen i think a full will be a great size for that room but either way it goes she's gonna get a bigger size bed and i'm gonna upgrade her uh dressers and upgrade her television probably do some painting in there um I'm going to have to get a carpet cleaner so that I can clean her carpet in her room. I, well, I need to clean the carpet anyway upstairs, y'all, because either I'm going to replace that carpet or I'm going to try my best to clean the carpet. But, y'all, it's a light color carpet. I had that carpet in the house since we moved in there. So, the carpet really needs to be pulled up, and I would rather have hardwood floors upstairs, but... Me and Tony, we're not on the same page with what we want upstairs. He want carpet. I want hardwood floors. But, so, until we come to an agreement, an agreement, then we'll decide on the flooring. But for right now, I think um, the best thing to do is to go ahead and clean the carpet that's upstairs. Get it clean as best as I can. And, uh, yeah, redo her room. But, yeah, she won't be girl stuff. So, she's turning 16. So, I say, yeah, I can do that. I can do that. I can upgrade your room. 
and plus I like to do projects like that anyway to be honest with you all my whole upstairs need to be redone I have not touched the upstairs my bedroom been the same for a long time my both of my girls rooms been the same for a very long time I have not upgraded the bathrooms so yeah I got some work to do I really got some work to do in that house to make it you know just another look bring another look and new vibe once you bring a new look to your space it brings in a whole nother vibe so yeah I'm just gonna do some upgrades to the upstairs probably some new painting some new light fixtures all of that type of stuff um, to the upstairs so I'm gonna take you guys along with the process with that um, I have not started ordering her stuff yet I'm sorry y'all I have not started uploading um, look at me saying upload I have not started um, ordering her stuff yet but um, I did see a bed on walmart.com and the bed is it's a real pretty bed y'all it's queen size and it's um, it's real pretty it's real girly got the rhinestones and the um, in the headboard and then on the bottom what I really like about it is the storage space it got like two drawers at the bottom of the bed so she can store some of her stuff under her bed in those drawers I think that was really really neat so I'm gonna order her that bed and it, don't, it didn't even cost that much y'all a little over two hundred dollars for that bed so really that's a really good uh, deal if it's great quality so I'm going to have to read the reviews on it before I order it. I'm going to read the reviews and then uh, probably go ahead and order her that bed. Let me get off of here and um, I'm going to pick you guys back up a little bit later. Hey y'all, we're headed to Walmart to go in and get some personal uh, hygiene items for the house. So I'm just going to take you guys along with me today. Right here. Do we got a, a barcode on it? You want to scan it with my phone? I got the app, don't it? Yeah, you should have the app. Have y'all tried the exotic rose shea sugar scrub? This kind? Oh, the Walmart? Yeah. Mm. It don't smell good. Then it got the 
blue raspberry. Oh, that smells good. Mm. I wouldn't want a bad one, but I mean, you know, you're right. With stuff like that. They got uh, the vanilla. That smells good. I like the vanilla kind of. Vanilla is always a go-to, and then they have the the wall the watermelon kind. And this is five dollars, y'all. Yeah. I don't like the watermelon kind. Nine dollars. Mm -hmm. It's a healthy too. Yeah. I get it. One got the um. They got the Dr. Teal's. Uh. Prebiotic, lemon balm. My battery fit to die. Oh, this smells good. For six ninety eight, this smells good. Hmm. Y'all, I did not know that they had the Dossier dupes in Walmart. Come on. A little saga. If you ever feel generous one day, you can just like come give me this. <laughs> Versace crystal. Mm hmm I wanna know what this smell like. $6. The price of this dossier is $28.98. But she liked the Versace. I wanna smell it. It's all locked up. What's this? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Juicy Couture. Hmm. Y'all, this smells hey guys. good. This smells really, really good. And we actually tried it. Hour. We Eos. actually tried it, y'all. And it's all Eos. Is Eos? Yes. It's all thick, y'all. Yeah. And it moisturizes. Mm -hmm. I might try some of this, y'all. Yeah. Eos. And it smells good. And it's with shea butter. It's called coconut waters. It smells good. So, hey, y'all. I done made it home. So I just want to go over everything that I purchased from Walmart. So the first thing I got was uh, <clears throat> some toothpaste. I got some Colgate, um, the Max Fresh, the Brush Strips, and I also got Crest, y'all, because some people like Colgate, some people like the Crest. Hold on, y'all. Okay, there it goes. Some people like Colgate and some people like Crest in this house. I like them both, but my go-to is the Colgate. And then I got the Crest uh, with Scope, y'all. And then I picked up some mouthwash. Everybody don't like this. Um, only me <laughs> in the house like this type of uh, mouthwash, but I got the healthy gums kind. And this is what I got. And we already have some Listerine upstairs. So I used this and I was out of it. So I just picked up one for myself. And then I saw this Dr. Teal's, y'all. Um, I got the um, the foaming bath with Epsom salt. Um, and this um, melatonin sleep bath. And I got this, y'all, because I'm fit to try to train Kingston to sleep in his own bed and i will be showing y'all his bed in another video but he get his own bed it's still going to be in my room but i'm gonna train him to sleep in his own bed instead of with me y'all because he still sleeps with me and i'm trying to wing him from sleeping with me and so he can sleep in his own bed and you know progress to his own room but uh, yes i got this to help him sleep <clears throat> I also, with the Dr. Tears, y'all, I smelled this in the store, and I love the way that it smells. It's the Lemon Balm Prebiotic Sugar Shrub. 
and it smells amazing y'all it's with sage uh thyme and essence oil y'all it smells so good oh i can't wait to try that it smells so good y'all <laughs> and then i picked up this twin pack of deodorant we use the suave deodorant and this is in the powder kind i got one for myself and one for my daughter And then I picked up this uh, SL's lotion. It's the 24-hour moisture shape better. It's a shape better. A better 24-hour moisturizer body lotion in coconut water. And it smells really, really good, y'all. And I also got um, the Dove Pink Rosa. This is the only soap that I use, y'all. I'm a Dove girl. I picked up some more washcloths, y'all. I like the white washcloths. I don't do color. And then um, I got me some more Folgers coffee. And then look, y'all. Have y'all tried these nuggets? It's called Real Good Nuggets, y'all. And the uh, nutrition facts on these are really, really good. It only has four carbs, one uh, dietary fiber, one gram of sugar, and 23 grams of protein, y'all. This is good. I tried these, and they almost taste like Chick-fil-A nuggets. But I really, really like these, y'all. So, these was at Walmart, and they like $6. I think they $6.98. So, if y'all haven't tried these... Go out and get your bag and try it, girl, because these, these nuggets taste good. And what else? Uh, Hold on, y'all. Now, uh, Tony got his air fryer going in the back. And then I, um, I went to the Dollar Tree, y'all, and I saw these, um, um, Flaw sticks, y'all. And I said these be in Target all the time and they overpriced. <laughs> so I decided to go ahead and get pick these up at the Dollar Tree for a dollar and uh 25 cent. I also got Kingston some, y'all. They have the kids size. Look at that. They got the kids size, and I uh got Kingston one. And then I got him some mouthwash too, the kids bubblegum flavor mouthwash. I got him his own personal mouthwash. Um, I got some razors, some batteries, and some more little stuff, y'all. Some little knickknacks. But so that's all that I really picked up, and I just want to share with y'all the haul that I picked up from Walmart. So I'm gonna get here and um, fix me something to eat, fix Kingston something to eat, and then I'll just pick you guys back up a little bit later. So hey y'all, I decided to come in the kitchen and make me a little snack for today. I got these zero sugar uh, yogurt, yogurt uh, cups and it's 50 calories, 11 grams of protein, zero sugar. So I'm going to eat one of these and I also I got me some strawberries that I picked up from the grocery store y'all I already washed them off so I'm just gonna cut me up a few strawberries add a few um, raspberry and some sunflower seeds so let's make a yoga bowl
back to the channel y'all today is tuesday yeah yeah today is tuesday and guess what i just received my walk pad y'all i'm so excited y'all the walk pad was supposed to come in last week here it is a whole nother week but it's here now so we're not going to dwell on what's going on behind the shipping and all that stuff but i got my walk pad y'all let's take a look so y'all look i got tony to bring it inside y'all it's in a little small box so i'm guessing that it's this big i don't know but we're gonna do an unboxing of it because i'm excited to see exactly how this bad baby gonna run yes i'm excited y'all i'm excited Could not wait till my husband get home in order for me to check out this walking pad. So let's unbox it together, y'all, and let's see what's all in the box. I'm so excited! Say hey, Kingston, while you walking past. Say hey. Hey. Okay. <laughs> so let's unbox it, y'all. I'm gonna unbox it with y'all, and let's see what's all in the package. Okay, I got my scissors, y'all. So let's unbox. instruction manual y'all and it got like the little uh tool to for screws it got a remote control the plug and some motor oil lubricant oil for motorized treadmill got two bottles of lubricant oil that to the side Should have waited on Tony. <laughs> I probably should have waited on Tony, y'all. But we are better. Oh, rip me out the plastic I've been acting brand new. Okay, y'all, so we have moved into the living room. I got it right here in this corner so that I can plug it up to that socket. Okay, so this is what it came with, y'all. It came with this remote control, and the remote control has a battery already in it. This is the remote, and this is the battery plug, y'all. It pops out. Well, I can't get it to pop out now, but it pops out and it already has a battery in it. And it also came with this replacement battery, okay? So you got two batteries for this thing, okay? 
you got two bottles of the um, a lubricant oil two bottles so I'm gonna put this up because I don't think I need it right now so I'm gonna put this up and this is to adjust your band and a plug so we're gonna go ahead and plug it up and let's see what this thing turn on I didn't get a chance to uh, see how far it uh, gets up to, but the speed that I went to uh, gave me a little workout. So I'm gonna try it now to see exactly how fast. Uh, how Oh, this remote don't work too good. Oh, there it goes. It's pretty loud. I do not like the remote already. Cause like I'm mashing it and it's it go when it wanna go. Okay, the fastest it get up to is 3.8, y'all. Let me show y'all. Okay, y'all. So that is the unboxing of my wall pad. I'm going to go ahead and put my tennis shoes on, y'all. Change out of this shirt and put on another shirt. And uh, get my workout on. I might as well. So I'll pick you guys back up later. Yeah.